Lauren, thank you. Turning now to our Space Coast, where NASA and SpaceX will be standing down from their scheduled mission to deliver cargo to the International Space Station. The reason? A possible fuel leak. News 6's James Barbero is in Brevard County with more. Our day-to-day -day activities involve running most of those experiments. Science experiments and supplies reach the International Space Station astronauts like Bob Hines through cargo missions. Lift off. Cargo Dragon soars. However, for its upcoming resupply run, NASA and SpaceX say there's now an issue with the Dragon capsule's thrusters. With the potential fuel leak discovered, NASA says the launch is no longer happening this week. Mission Control in Houston telling the space station crew to possibly expect the launch June 28th at the earliest. We are no-go for nominal EVAs. In a press conference last month, NASA addressed a spacesuit leak during a spacewalk by astronaut Matthias Maurer. It was noted that Marr had water in his helmet. The Dragon flying to the station for the cargo mission is supposed to bring home Maurer's spacesuit for a closer look. Until then, NASA says it's canceling all regular extravehicular activities. So this delay definitely has an impact on resolving that problem. And until they get the suit back and fix this, normal spacewalks are no go on the space station. And NASA and SpaceX say they'll wait to officially announce the next launch date until after the exact source of the problem discovered during fueling is identified. In Cape Canaveral, Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, getting results, News 6.